The advice would be to use Titus, Oren, and Waka during that fight. Because Waka can blind him, Oren can power break him, and Titus can haste everyone, cheer everyone, and yeah, attack really fast. Praise be to Yevon. That's what I would have said if I was a follower of Yevon. We were all there, and in one piece, even if I had a headache from wondering what was in store for us next. Riku's a huge help in the next area. We're under the lake ice, aren't we? Look, that's the bottom of the temple. <sighs> We've fallen a long way. Guys, they're not dead. What now, I wonder? What now? Uh, you act first and think later, don't you? I mean, can't you be a little more responsible? We're all depending on you, you know? A lecture. No, no, no. <laughs> Just a suggestion. 
You should place trust in your friends. But you can't expect someone to protect you all the time. You would do well to remember that. Is that a lecture? It's advice. Hey, Wonka, would you cheer up? Look, we only did what we had to do. It doesn't matter. Don't you see? I've always walked the path of Yevon. But now, I'm a traitor. How could this happen? Damn! It's not Riku's fault either. Huh? You don't know how I feel. Yuna will wake soon. Kimari knows this. Treasure. I'm sure Yuni's okay. She's breathing fine and all. How are Lulu and Waka? Uh, well, Waka's in shock. Can't blame him either. And Lulu, well, she's just the same as always. She's so together. All grown up, I guess. I guess. Well, just give me five or six more years. So, Kamari, how do we get out of here? Hey, don't change the subject. Can we climb? Kimari too. Only those who try will become. Huh? I think he means you have to work hard if you want to be like Lulu. Oh, I will. Kimari think Riku should stay Riku. Huh? Hey, are you saying I'll never be like Lulu? Kimari! <laughs> How could you laugh at a time like this? Uh, no, he's saying you should stay Yuna? be yourself. I want to confront Maester Seymour about his father, Lord Jiskel. I wanted to convince him to turn himself in to Yevon's judgment. In exchange for marriage? Yes, if that's what it took. So, what did Seymour say? He didn't say anything. Now, I... Now I don't even think it was worth it. I should have told you what I was going to do. Enough. Dwelling in the past is futile. Hey, you don't have to say it like that. You want to waste time listening to her regrets. You don't have to say it like that. Our immediate concern is Yuna's pilgrimage. Are you willing to go on? Yes. But then, do you think Yevon will allow it? The Faith are the ones that give power to the Summoners. Not the Temples or the Teachings. If the Temples try to stop us, then we will defy Yevon if we must. Whoa! I can't believe you said that! Hmm. Sir Oren? Count me out. We have to atone to make up for the sins we have committed. Of course, it's not like I ever liked Maester Seymour, yeah? No way I'll ever forgive him for killing Lord Jiskel and for trying to do us all in two, you know? But still, the bunch of us going against Yevon? No way! But still, we have transgressed and must face our punishment. We must go to Bevel. We must speak with Maester Micah and explain what has happened. There is no other way, I think. I agree. Uh, Sir Oren? So it is decided. Will you come with us? I am the troublemaker, after all. Yeah, that's 
right. You can always count on Aaron to complicate things. <laughs>